Hi, my friend. It's John Pike. I just want to personally give you a very warm welcome to my training here at yourdownundertips.com. What I'm going to do right now is show you how to whitelist your email to make sure that your emails that you want to receive don't go down into the spam folder where you don't see them. I'm also going to be reviewing some of the not so new features now with Gmail with their promotions tab and other. So hang around, I'm also going to be showing you how it all works in Yahoo as well. So check this training out. Again, thanks and welcome. Look forward to sharing this with you and I'll see you in just a moment. Welcome again to this training. Look, the first thing I want to show you right now, you may not realize this, this came in a few months ago, but what Gmail actually do is, I don't know if you realize it, but this is your main inbox as soon as you sign in. There's social here, and the thing is, your emails won't go there. What you'll do is get notifications here from YouTube and also from Google+. Like this. You can see how you get notifications with Google Plus and YouTube. What I'd like to draw your attention to is over here under Promotions. What you'll find, forget about spam just for a moment, if you click on that tab, you'll actually find that some of your emails and some of my emails might be going in here. Okay, so that's just as a bit of a start, okay guys? When you're getting a lot of emails from top marketers, you will find that some of them will go in this promotions tab, so always check there. Be aware of that in addition to this primary tab here. All right, now let's go ahead and have a look, as I mentioned, about how to go ahead and whitelist your email so that it doesn't go into your spam folder. Here is how you can make sure that a certain email goes through to your inbox instead of being lost in the spam folder in Gmail. What you do is you go ahead and go up to this wheel over here for settings and go ahead and click the down arrow. You then go ahead and go down to settings in that area right here and click on settings. So guys, you can see that you're in the settings area. Go over here to filters in the middle and click on filters. And then go ahead down here to click on create a filter. And then in the from area, go ahead and type in the email. So in this case, John Pike 7 at gmail.com. Type that in. Click create filter with this search. And then you just go over here and choose never send to spam. And you can do this with any email series that you want to make sure that you see in your inbox and don't have to go searching for it in the actual spam folder. So go ahead and click on create filter. And then it says here that your filter was created. So there you go. That's all you have to do in Gmail. Hope that was helpful. Now I'm just going to show you how to go ahead and add a email address to contacts, your contact list in Yahoo, so that you make sure that you get emails not going through that you want to see each time in your inbox, not going through to the spam folder. Go up here and you'll see this little icon here for contacts, where the little picture of a person is. Click on that. Go ahead and click on New Contact. And what will happen over here is you can put the first name in, so go ahead and put John, tab down, put surname, Pike, and then go ahead and put, I'll just fix that up, Pike, P-I-K-E, and just drop down here to email and put John Pike 7 at gmail.com. Then what you do is just go ahead and scroll down to the bottom and click Save. And what you'll see is the new contact details have just come up here so you know you're successful. Alrighty. Now I just want to show you over in Gmail what this process looks like. Because what you do is just go over here to Gmail, click that down arrow and then click on Contacts. Just click here 
that little box there, and then just go up to Add to Contacts. Well, there you go, guys. That's how you go ahead and stop your email going into spam in both Gmail and Yahoo. Again, welcome to this training. It is really great to have you. Hope you enjoyed this training as well. Keep your eyes open for the inbox for your next installment of training, and I'll look forward to catching up with you in the next video. All the very best, and bye for now.